In China, there's a very famous saying, opportunity would only favor those people with a prepared mind. All the experience I have accumulated and the skill sets I have mastered have all been helping me to be where I am. But more important than that is the people I've been working with. They have been tremendously helpful for me. I graduated from Renmin University of China, majored in international economics. After graduation, I pursued a master's degree in economics in University of Hawaii. So I always view myself as an economist. I was very lucky that Microsoft had an opportunity for me to manage their treasury cash investment portfolio. And I was very lucky not only you know, seeing Bill Gates having some meetings with him, but also really get an exposure to the tech industry, which later on opens different doors for me. After six years working for Google Treasury, I want to get close to the Google's core business. So that's where I am to support the consumer product operation. Starting to see a decline, yeah. but it should be coming back up. When you look at our technology it's industry, okay. you will very quickly find out you have to work with a team. When you work as a group, you collect all the intelligence and all the wisdoms together that sparks new ideas to the next level. Besides work, I have many hobbies, such as dancing, you know, painting arts. I've never learned dancing in a professional way, but to me, it brings the best part of the beauty of yourself to the audience. Without the family's support, I wouldn't be able to find the time to do that. And even for my kids, I appreciate them teaching me a lot. They were born and raised in America. So American culture is the natural DNA in their mind. They help me to get closer to the American culture and to the American value. Being humble is not only unique to you know, Chinese, but also you know, people of other cultures like Japanese or Korean, they also share this, some similar value. It's not like I want to discount my contribution, but it's more about I want to emphasize the team's contribution. I want to influence the culture to make it more collaborative, to make it more inclusive. For women leaders, don't be afraid of being a woman. Rather than changing your personality, reflect yourself. See what is most valuable to you, what is most important to you. And if you believe these are already generating the impact, continue in that. I believe I have a true heart to work with my team members and my colleagues. Some of my colleagues and the managers call that as your genuine leader. I think that's one of the best regard I can receive. I'm happy with that. No matter what a business decision or personal decision you make, if you do that with your good will, good face, it will carry on. Mm -hmm.